You seem tense, Sebastian. Here's a tip. Always start with a joke. Get on stage. Yes, you're on. Attitude, posture, and go. Go, go, go! Thank you. You are too, really too kind. I have been told that these are my most accessible designs yet. But don't let the bright colors and the classical cuts fool you. No, no, no. The themes I've explored here are perhaps my darkest yet. I've explored feelings of powerlessness, the rest, Coercion. The notion that free will is only an illusion. That we are all controlled by sinister forces simply preying on our vices and weaknesses. But, uh, like the pleasant design suggests, we put on a brave face. A mask of normality. To make us appear happy. Successful. Above all, in control. But deep down, who really is? Thank you. And good night. How are we doing? I dare say things could be sped up a bit, don't you agree?
evening, Mr. Ruger. Thank you, thank you, yes, well, I knew from the very start that I'd have to completely rethink how Sanguine operates in the post-consumerist world of high fashion, and... That's, that's fascinating, but, but tell me, is it true there's bad blood between you and Sebastian Sato? The public needs to know. Sebastian and I are like two, two peas in a pod. Uh, uh-huh, and, and what is it, what is this that we hear about the, um, super-exclusive members-only club on the second floor? Is there any truth to the rumors that you and Dahlia Magolis are hosting celebrity orgies? Oh, good, good God, young lady, please. Seek help, you clearly need it. We have a bunch of this Dahlia. Oh, Mr. Kruger, I'm delighted. Sir, Helmut, my man. You don't remember me? Uh, Mr. Kruger, let me know if you need new bodyguards. Okay? Call me. Where are you? Looking awesome, Mr. Where are Kruger. You? Ah, same shit, different day. Good evening, sir. Please come in. I hope you enjoy yourself. Mr. Jordan Cross? Tren Poe. You have been expecting my call. Indeed, I have been following your band's career with great interest and wish to commission a piece of music in honor of my upcoming coronation. Yes, I am thinking a post-punk version of Wagner. Strong and stirring yet dangerous and deviant. Mothers lock up your daughters, eh? <laughs> great stuff. <laughs> Anyway, your composition will be performed at the Royal Ceremony, seven months from now. Sixteen million cassette tapes are to be distributed amongst my subjects, who will listen to it twice a day, or face three generations of forced farm labor. 
Excellent. I'll have my people call your people. We'll get some. Helmut! Looking as fresh as ever. I want to be just like you, Mr. Kruger. Yes, I'm at the auction. Well, the less you know, the better. Plausible deniability and all that. Let's just say, if I get what Marco was promised me, the Chinese are done dicking us around. Cross? Thomas? Cross? <laughs> but... <laughs> That's fantastic, Jacqueline. How big a contribution? Holy crap. That is some golden ticket, boss. But what does Cross want in return? The guy's as Republican as college football and evil. Why switch sides now? Hmm. No harm in meeting, I suppose. But I'm extremely skeptical about this. It feels like asking the vampire on your doorstep to just come right in. No, don't worry. I'll wrap this up and be back in time for McAvoy. You're in. Good work. So this is the auction of secrets. Oh, 